I am Old Man Sugarheart, and today we are playing Love Ghosty. We are almost done, and it got uh, it got a little weird yesterday, or the last time we played. Good morning, Darth Chaos. Lying down with the plushies. Good call. My kitty is hopping up on my lap. Uh. I was re-watching my video the other day. Apparently while I was typing something out, I accidentally duplicated the file and started that. Because apparently it had keyboard access while I was typing somewhere else, so I've got the game over here. Really glad I didn't accidentally, or nothing I typed had the word F in it, because I could have deleted my save and we would have had to start over from scratch. But anyway. Here we are. There are only six animals left to doink. Let's see if these two want to doink. Hey Mina, what are you up to this weekend? I didn't have anything planned yet, why? Perfect, you're coming with me to a haunted house. What? I didn't agree to this. Nonsense, you said you were free, so you don't have anything better to do anyway, right? I hate scary things. I can think of a million things I'd rather do than a haunted house. Well, come on, Mina. You don't, I don't have anyone else to go with, and it's no fun to go by myself. <sighs> Fine. Don't make me regret this. Woo, thanks, Mina. It'll be fun. What am I getting myself into? Yeah, I don't like that interaction. Like, I know they're going to, like, twist twist it and m make that relationship work out somehow. But that's not a promising start. Alright, new minigame. Matchmake residents in the living room. There's an obvious pair. Felix and Sky. They're the only people I 100% approve of. I don't know what to do with the other four. Time to do some matchmaking by matching pairs of cards. We did this last time. And apparently didn't remember the things we did last time, and that's okay. Yep, uh, fine pairs. Flip over, try to match them. If you flip them, have to choose one card from the board to discard. Cool. Ready, let's go. Okay, so that's a two. That was a three. Uh, I got this. Okay, so you're one. You have to be one. You are three. You have to be three. Uh, what am I missing? I've got two, and I need a two. It's actually super risky for me to discard one of those guys. Oh, hey! We did it! Big hearts. Good for you, too. Oh! Right now, we're something special from from the store. Sorry, a little bit of a coughing fit. Hey there. Classical, classic musical noisy. You know what? Mina gave you this. He looks like he would enjoy that sort of thing. Actually, basketball hoop would seem more his style. How'd this go? Mina, have I ever told you how much I love how your room looks? Let me guess. You think it's cute. I guess so. It's cute. Like you. Mm hmm. 
Oh no, have I upset you? What's wrong? You know, I don't choose to be cute, Apollo. I just happen to be cute with everything I do. That's a bad thing? No, I'm just saying there's more to me than that. I'm sure there is. And I'd like to learn about that too. R really? Of course. Okay. I dated a cute girl once. And she got upset at being called cute. She's like, I don't want to be cute. I want to be sexy. So, like, I get it. Cute people are never sexy. Like, they always... Yeah, everyone always calls them cute because it's the safer thing to call somebody. I mean, I feel it too. It never upset me, though. Who gets the big fancy leaf? I mean, obviously, you are the fashionable one, but the leaf just clashes with everything in here. So you are going to give it to the frog. Alright. Did we ever... Check out... Like, no? Oh, okay, we've seen everything. Oh, you love the big fancy leaf, did you? Allen, come with me. Huh? Uh, sure. W what is this? A movie theater. We're gonna go watch the new horror movie that just came out. W what? No, I'm not ready for this at all. It's fine. It's not that scary. No, I mean, I don't have any money on me. Don't worry. I don't either. We're gonna lie our way in. What? Just follow my lead. Um, hello there. I'm the theater inspector, and I'm here to make sure everything is up to code at this facility for its annual grade. This here is my colleague. He will also be joining me in this inspection. That's right, I'm here to watch the movies for free officially. Because we're movie watchers, real ones. I mean, inspectors, which is like the same word. Isn't that weird? <laughs> oh dear. All right, that was a thing that happened. Outdoorsy and bright. Let's see, going to the beach. Who would go to the beach? Sky and Felix are going to the beach. Musical and playful. Is anybody here musical? Probably her. She's gonna play the violin or something. Or is she dark and unusual? Get rid of the pests. Well, she's obviously dark. Okay, so... Ooh, but... I'll only eat the bugs. There we go. We got this. Alright, let's watch these dates. Well, we're at the beach. What do you usually do here? I don't know, some shade and let the ocean wash away the sounds of the world? For a moment, I like to close my eyes and experience the calm completely. That's what I love to do here, too. Should we find some shade together? I'll find us some shade. That's perfect. Today is perfect. The perfect day and the perfect person to spend it with. The perfect day for me because I'm because of the person I'm spending it with. Ah, uh, yeah, that was a very special date. Right? Uh, 
Let's see. Self care. Uh, boop. One. Oh, I almost nailed it. Uh, one. One. There we go. All right. Uh. Hmm. He's got max happiness. Like, I feel like... I think I read something that he can move out without dating anybody, but just to see how it goes. And drop a bunch of noirs on him. Because Alan and Noir feel like the least dateable people to me. I mean, we all want to date, like, a, a, a big goth goat, but I just don't think she's, she's very polite, and she looks like she's very high maintenance. <coughs> Excuse me. Felix and Sky. Yes. They were meant to get, be together. Okay, I'm back. Whoa, what is all this? Well, I gathered all the stuff we brought together. And I thought we could camp in the living room. Got camping simulator on my console. You can make s'mores and watch constellations in the living room. That is amazing! And then, we can play beach simulator together. We'll change into our swimming trunks and build sandcastles on it. Finally, we can wrap things up by laying out the picnic blanket and sharing your favorite soup while we play Picnic Simulator together. Sky, you're a genius! Oh, thanks, Felix. I figure which one, whichever one we enjoy doing the most, maybe we can try that date for real later. If we love doing all of them, I guess we'll have to do all of them for real. Perfect. You keep saying, like, do you want to view their diaries for the last time, but, like, I, I read their diaries every day. Where'd they go? All right. Aren't Felix and Sky so cute? I miss them already. Oh, did you see what they left on the memories board? Sky, have you tried the newest level in Camping sim Simulator? It's intense. I get it. I've not. I had no idea the game was so intense. Yeah, the night levels are so realistic. You can't see anything. You remember to turn the game on before putting on the headset? You've got to try this game. It's even better when the game is on. On my way. Ah. Look at him. It was probably the best relationship we've had. Like, Calathea and uh, Shamel were my favorite la relationship. But, like, the one that actually makes the most uh, sense is Sky and Felix. Good morning, old man Sugarheart. Good morning, Kaizen. A.K.A. Sleeper. How are you doing? Goodness, what was that back there, Alan? I panicked. You can stop yelling. They let us in. You think he bought our story? No. He let us through out of embarrassment and pity. I'm not used to lying like that, Noir. It's just not princely. It's hilarious. I've never seen someone lie that badly. Well, I've never been so mortified in my whole life. That was completely uncalled for and humiliating. Come on, Alan. You did fine. We got through, didn't we? Can't even stand to watch the movie now. Enjoy it by yourself. Wait, Alan, come back. Yeah, I think... 
I think I, I kind of want them to be in a relationship together if for no other reason than because Like, uh, Owen's got the money to actually deal with, like, high-maintenance problems that she, she will clearly have. And he's also got, like, this, uh, selfishness about him that, you know, would kind of offset her selfishness problems. Like, I think they might end up being good for each other, even though they're terrible people. Your diary. I have never been so embarrassed in my life, nor wanted to sneak into a movie theater, but I can't handle lying under the pressure. Okay. Here, I found another goth thing for you. It can be from Allen. And you, you're a prince of sorts. You can have... A suit of armor from from her. All right, where is everybody? They're hanging out. That's fine. Oh, and I'm sorry about what happened back there. I didn't mean to embarrass you. Thought you'd be able to play along with me, with how energetic and outgoing you are. Nor I appreciate your apology. We should include me in about what you were planning to do. I don't like sudden shifts in plans or ideas. It stresses me out. Of course, Alan, I should have asked you before. Thought playing it cool was best, but now I see that that doesn't work best for everyone. It's okay, Noir. Sorry about ditching you at the theater. That was the movie. I didn't watch it. What? After all that effort and deception? I only wanted to watch it with you, but after what happened... I'm sorry. I should go. Ooh. The plot thickens. What we got over here? Dear Diary, Apollo says he wants to know more about you. What's the best way to help him with that? I don't know, hot dates? Let's see, what is the date? Fashionable, fancy, practical. Go shopping. It sounds like another all-in noir date. Like, they're just so predictable. Bright and cute. That would be you. And that just leaves Apollo. Everything's kind of fallen into place. Like when you're almost out of animals, it can you just get what you get. I'm glad you came shopping with me, Alan. Well, you did seem very insistent that I come with you for this. Yes, you see, you are perfect. What? Nora, that's so the perfect model for this new line of clothing I want to check out. Oh, I thought for a moment you meant. Oh yeah. You're perfect too, Holland. What? You are perfect. Even when you're not perfect. Especially when you aren't. If anyone makes you feel like you're not good enough, I will obliterate them. What if the person makes that makes me feel like I'm not good enough is me? I said what I said. Thanks, Noir. Anytime, Holland. Wow. Obliterate me, mommy. Two, four, boop. Yay. Let's see. Oh, there's lots of money out here. Anyway, we're gonna dump it all on the cat. And a good chunk of it went in money. That's fine.
Their date was special. Their relationship increased a lot. Happiness, relationships. It was just love everywhere. Apollo is neat. Noir is serious. I've learned things. Let's see how I did. Relationships. Alright, the game's almost over. So money song's probably not good. Vacation ticket decoration mode? Okay, if the hats are 30, yeah, we can get all the cool stuff. So accessories, hats, and decoration mode. It's the last things I'm interested in and that I think people might want to check out. Let's try on our new stuff. Oh! I can change my, my tail stuff. It's gonna be... I don't know, music notes? I kinda like leaves, actually. And where are the new hats? That's kind of okay. Got some little tiefling horns. A beanie. And get the headphones. And then we'll go with the music notes out the back. There we go. Oh my god, look what my residents did! I gave my residents a plushie and they put it in their bed! So cute! Yeah. And give residents a plushie? Dear diary, I brought all in shopping with me the other day and looked in... He looked good in everything, it's unfair! I even had him wear a trash bag and he looked ethereal! I didn't think anyone could outdo me, but here we are. Don't worry, you can outdo each other. And now you two. Would would you like to... hear the song of my people? Apollo, you said you wanted to learn more about me? So here, what, what's this? It's a list of all my known strengths and weaknesses. But why do I want to know that? Because you said you wanted to know more about me. Wait, under weakness it says floral prints? Yes, I like patterns. But my wallet doesn't like it, so it's a weakness. You wrote merciless understrengths and weakness. It's been the solution to and cause of a lot of problems. Mina, I don't need a list like this. Wait, understrength, it says dodgeball? You... you play dodgeball? Not often, but when I do, I'm very good at it. Okay, I gotta see this. I do like Mina. Mina is cool. Apollo seems decent. I'll allow it. Here, a goth candle. Or you. From on, obviously. Let's see, he's a big nerd. Where do you get a big nerd? A pile of books!
Here you go, nerd. Enjoy. Alright. Now I can enter decorate mode. Let me see how that works. Looks like I unlock decorating. And when you see something, someone leave a pizza on their bed, you can move it from here. You can pick up and replace objects in different spots. See, that's what I was thinking. In case you forgot, when you're alive, some objects can only fit in certain places. You can also decorate common items with areas items from your inventory. Don't worry. None of this costs any action points. You can decorate as much and as often as you like. Okay. Obviously the tea set goes here. Oh. You only have one slot on the wall to put things? Tea set can't go here? Alright. All I know is it doesn't belong on the bed. Okay, what other options do I have for decorating? Uh, she's got things pretty alright. Did this guy put the jukebox, like, here? Yeah, that makes sense. What about you? Your stuff makes sense, too. We're good. Dear Diary, Nora ended up not watching that movie. I had no idea she only wanted to watch it with me. Huh, I have an idea. Okay. I'm gonna have Mina. Please, please let me select Mina. There we go. Play a game. Yep. Match all twos. I'll see what I can do. Uh. Alright, so I need to find the two of hearts. Whoops. I have messed up. Anyway, uh, two, two. Uh, this is a three. And I can't match the other two because that would be impossible. Boy, I've really messed up. Uh, three and three. No? Three and three. I did that one completely wrong. Okay, whatever. They like each other. Nerdy, creative, unusual. Go to a convention. Honestly, I'd kind of like to see how a lot of them would react, but... I feel like Nora would hate a convention. He is not nerdy enough, so Apollo has to go. Uh... Neither of these people know how to cook dinner. But Nora's gonna give it a try. Oh, how did I lose relationship points? Shrug. I did my math wrong, I should have had three. Does this cost relationship points? Guess it might. Later that day. I'm so excited about this convention. There's this show I watch, I want merch for. And this one artist is selling a convention exclusive pin set. Wait, is this show called That Time I Turned Into a Convention Attendee? 
The pin set is called convention only pin set. How did you know? Are you kidding? I've been following them for ages. I'm so glad I came here with you. Me too. I entered the raffle for this high ticket item, but there are only two winners out of tens of thousands of attendees. I entered it too. We probably won't win, but Mina and Apollo, you have won two high ticket items. Please come and collect your prize. Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the best convention ever! Woo! Let's see. You are cooking dinner, are you? Dump some hearts on that frog. Yeah, the frog was hard to target in that one. Date was good. Relationship increased. Everybody loves everything. Noir is complex. Is she, though? I mean, she seems like the simplest person to understand, really. Dear Diary, Alden gifted me a gothic candle. I don't think I like how it makes me feel. I'm too happy. You can never know. Oh, and what is going on here? Your diary. Wow, Mina plays dodgeball. I had no idea. I can't wait to see her play. Do you have a diary entry? Once again, I shall sing you the song of my people. 